Good morning, Piscianos. Good morning. I hope you guys had a good night's sleep. I hope you woke up today feeling happy, safe, and peaceful. Thank you to everyone that has liked, commented, subscribed, done personals, and gave donations. You know what song I woke up to? Well, in my head. I don't even listen to this song. I, I have heard it, yes. I think it was the 2000s, 90s, I'm gonna remember. But um, I think it was Beanie Siegel. In the air, in the air, something like that. I don't even know the words to it, but I woke up with that song in my head and I stepped outside of my porch. And you know, it's strange weather out there. I don't know if there's a storm coming, I should check, but there's some type of strange weather or vibe out there, you know? So I don't know. In the end. Oh, and yeah, I did um, notice I had to take my, um, what is that, my salmeterol, my Adbear, and um, my, um, my Flonase. Yeah, I had to take both. Because, I don't know, it's not good out there. As soon as I stepped outside, like I felt a bunch of stuff in my throat. My allergies started kicking up. So I'm like, whoop, I ran back to my house, took both my stuff. So the air quality is very bad, at least out here. I don't know. I don't know until it reaches everywhere. But that's something else that I got. The air quality is already bad and it's about to get worse. So is what it is, people. Enjoy your lives as much as you can not ending or anything but you know it's never gonna be the way it used to be and that's okay that is okay enjoy that life Pisces all right nine of wands page of cups and the eight of cups in the reversal Pisces, the energy that I'm getting is that there's kind of someone that has, wants to let go of whatever happened in the past. I see that with the Knight of Wands, Pisces. Um, like they want to let it go. I'm going to go deeper because that's really all I'm feeling. Then with that page of cups, I see it, the nine of wands looking over at that page of cups. Page of cups to me, especially in the reversal, is always kind of like a little insane card. You know, there's a little, something a little wrong with you. Pisces, I'll be honest, I'm getting this as your energy today. Um, I don't think there's anything wrong with you. I think you just see things and hear things um, that most people can't. Um, I also told you about your feelings and your emotions and how sensitive you are and how you pick things up. Trust me, I understand all this stuff. Um, I don't know if people are now agreeing with you or looking towards you, seeing what you see. I don't really know exactly. We'll go deeper. What I'm getting from that Eight of Cups Pisces in the reversal, sorry, Seven of Cups in the reversal Pisces is there's only one choice. That's what I keep hearing. There's only one choice. There's only one choice in one direction. I don't know what the hell that means, Pisces. There's only one choice. There's only one clear choice. All right, let's get deeper because this is a stumper. This is a stumper. All right, tell me more about this nine of wands in the reversal spirit. Tell me more. People are looking towards you for guidance, Pisces. They want to hear something different. Hair font in the reversal. Queen of Cups in the reversal. And I just looked at the Hermit as well. That was on the bottom of the deck. I didn't put that grip. Okay. <sighs> Powerful energy right here with the Hair font and the Queen of Cups. More in tune. I feel like this person, Pisces, is okay. So I don't know if you told them something, but I feel like they're seeing whatever it is that you told them. 
Um, it's like they saw the light, like a light shined on them in a situation, and now they realize that you're not a fake, you're not a phony, you know, you're not a liar, you're not crazy with that page of cups and insanity, even though it come, it's still coming off as crazy energy. But I, I'm, you know, I'm okay with it. I hope you guys are okay with it. I think you guys are, you know. Um, but I feel like they've kind of seen the light, they kind of seen the way. And they want to bury the hatchet. Pisces, you know, it's, it's giving me the energy like this person is dying. And I'm not saying they are, but it, that's what it's giving me. It's like they, they walked into a whole new world where they're kind of feeling like they need to make amends with you. That's the energy that I'm getting there, Pisces. It's like I have to make amends. I have to let this shit go. Like they had a lot of uh, contemplation. They were thinking about this for a lot. They, they did some soul searching. I feel like they had some type of supernatural moment. Hierophant to me has always been um, the closest thing to God. You know, it, it's like your connection to God, like, a, you know, above, you know, so you, you have the feet here on the earth, but you have those fingers. You see the way the fingers are elevated up. It's like you're getting answers from above. So I feel like this person, Pisces, I don't know who this is, boyfriend, girlfriend, you know, um, family member, friends, whoever, but I feel like they've seen the light. Literally, they've seen the light. They heard the truth. They understand what's going on. And they did a lot of, um, they, a lot of wisdom, I guess, was shed onto them. And they want to let it go. Now, take it how it resonates. This could be vice versa. I'm kind of feeling Pisces, but take it how it resonates. That's how it's coming across to me, Pisces. They want to let this go. I feel like they trust you. Is that weird to say that? I feel like they trust you now. I don't know why I'm saying these things, Pisces. You'll know, I guess, but I don't. Tell me more about this page of cups in the reversal spirit. Six of cups in the reverse, knight of pentacles. Yeah, you're disenchanted. That's the energy that I'm feeling here. Page of cups and six of cups. You want different things now, Pisces. Um, I feel like you are willing to forgive. That is the, the vibe. I feel like you've grown into like a higher person, a higher being. So you know that forgiveness is the way. You understand that. Um, but you're also not stupid. And you also know their level of understanding. And you're no longer seeing things. Six of Cups to me in the reversal is like seeing things through rose-colored glasses. You know? It's like you, you saw things. You tried to look at the good in people. And that's wonderful. I still do it. Especially with the people that I love. You know? Like you have to. But... There's something else about you now, Pisces. Like, I don't know if you, you just elevated spiritually. I feel, Pisces, like you're listening to your future self now. Like your future self is in contact with you. Something in the air. I'm telling you, there's something in the air. And it's like you walk through a new portal, a new dimension. Or your future self has come to you and spoken to you and is guiding you now. There's something happening, Pisces. Something is happening really slow. I don't know why I just got that with that Knight of Pentacles. I don't know if you're still in a place of growth. I'm going to throw one more out, Pisces. There's something that's happening that's really slow. Tell me a little bit more about this Knight of Pentacles spirit. Tell me a little bit more. Um, no, too many. It's like you're ready. You're ready for the light. You're like a soldier of the light. That's what I'm feeling, Pisces. You're a soldier of the light. We need all these soldiers of the light, Pisces. You know, I put a crucifix on my front door. That helps a lot. Be of the light. That's the energy that I'm getting. You are a soldier of the light. That's what it is. Oops. Soldier of the light, Pisces. You will be a soldier of the light for as long as you're here on this earth. All right, tell me a little bit more about this Knight of Pentacles. Okay. And the King of Pentacles. 
You'll be a soldier of the light for as long as you're here on this earth. And then I get the King of Pentacles, Pisces. You're going to be upgrading. You're definitely upgrading. Um, for some of you, this could be in projects as well, things that you've been working on, financial stuff. I know I'm talking more spiritual, um, so let me bring it back down to earth, even though I feel like we're talking about the earth for some reason with the pentacles, I guess. You're going to be growing. Regardless of the fact you're going to be growing, whether it's in money, spirituality, your fight for God, you're going to become more powerful. You're going to be drenched with the power of the Holy Spirit. You're paying your dues. That's the energy that I'm feeling, Pisces. You're paying your dues. You see the way. Your way is clear, Pisces. You're not confused anymore. Tell me more about this Seven of Cups, Pisces, um, Spirit. Tell me more about this Seven of Cups in the reversal. There's only one choice. One clear choice. Tell me more, because <laughs> that is confusing. This might, reading is all confusing for me at least, but I hope it on, you guys get it. Three of Swords in the reversal and the Lover's card. There's only one clear choice. We're going to be healing the world with love. That's the energy that I'm getting here. Letting go of pain. Healing. There's a lot of healing that needs to get done, Pisces. I know a lot of you are warriors of Christ, warriors of the light, whatever you see yourself as. You know, I understand what you are. You know, I know that a lot of you have gravitated towards me because you, you have a similar light. I know that. I feel like we're going to win. That's the energy that I'm getting. Good always beats evil. Love always beats hate. And that's the energy that I'm getting here. There's only one choice. Do not meet hate with more hate. Meet that pain. You know, it's kind of like what I was telling you with my boyfriend. When my boyfriend gets off the rail with, you know, some political thing. I'm not political whatsoever. Not, I just do what my intuition tells me to do. Um, but he's very political. And, you know, when he gets off the rail, I'll give him a big kiss and a big hug. And I'll tell him, I love you. You know, and that seems to always bring him back. Sometimes it takes a couple kisses, but for the most part, it brings him back. So that's the energy that I'm feeling here, Pisces. Whatever issue that you're trying to overcome, whatever, you know, um, circumstance, I think God has given you the power, the ability, and the love to connect with people. All you got to do is show them that love. Show love, Pisces. I'm not saying to those people that got, you know, hurt, who deal with narcissists, I'm not talking to, the, uh, to those people. To those people, you close the door and you say goodbye. And what I'm talking about is the people that you still care about, that you love, that need healing in themselves. If you're able, I feel like God has passed a light to you that's able to help others. So in any way that you can, help that person if you can. You can't help them all. Remember that, Pisces. You can't help them all. But if you can help one, you've done your job. And I know you have already. I know who I'm talking to. I know you've helped a couple people already in your lives. And you're about to help more. You are a soldier, a war, like a, a knight. You fight here on this earth. And you're about to be promoted. That's the energy that I'm getting here. You're about to be promoted, Pisces. All right, this was highly spiritual. It happens sometimes. Let's see. God is here. God is with us. He sees all. He sees you. More importantly, Pisces, that's the energy that I'm getting. He sees you. You are a good person and you are deserving. What people, and I said this to you before, what people look at as crazy is just because they don't understand that some people vibrate at a different frequency. Doesn't make them crazy. Spirit, what advice do we have for Pisces? What advice do we have for Pisces?
schizophrenia. Yeah, I was just talking about the crazy Pisces. They think you're crazy. There you are. I always say this, and I was talking about you. You tap into the two worlds. I've said this to you before, and I just said that sentence, there the card goes. I know what I feel, Pisces. I know what I feel. I know who a lot of you are out there. You're gifted for a reason. It's not bad. Your gifts are not bad. It's just learning how to take care of yourself first. Give to yourself first so you're able to do the work, so you're able to help others, so you're able. You know, it's no coincidence, Pisces, that, you know, Pisces people are filled with a lot of love. You know, we, we love hard. There's a reason for that because God needs us. God needs us to shed light on love to other people. Some people may think you're crazy, schizophrenia, but you're not. You're just tapping into the universe, into the two worlds. I am feeling timeline jumping. I've been feeling that. Your future self may be communicating with your current self or vice versa. I don't know, but I feel it. I've been feeling it and I'm feeling it again, Pisces. So this is confirmation for you. If you woke up today and you said something feels different, you're right. You leveled up. You've been given more energy, more strength, and, with, and, more, and more love. And I always say this line, I know it's from Spider-Man, but it is what it is. With great power comes great responsibility. Be humble. Use your power for good. All right, Pisces, I hope you like the reading. Please like and subscribe, and thank you.